seen this before. Uh, some of y'all were kind of grossed out about it, but uh, it's a delicacy. And um, Melanie used to frown on it, but then uh, when I showed her how it's cooked, then everything is she loves it. They are called sweetbreads or mollejas in Spanish. What it actually is, it's just this one piece here. It's I, what I do is is you get them in a package and I boil them first so they'll tender make them a little more tender and it makes it easier to to cut and I'm quite pleased with uh, these packs that I got um, they butterfly it out really well because Melanie likes them a little crispier um, otherwise you could leave them thicker and just cook them longer but uh, I cut them butterfly them out Booby you can't have any right now anyway um, a butterfly these things out so they'll cook more even and be crispier and this one's a good size uh, piece here I'm going to cut it in several but as you can see it resembles if you want I'll give you a close-up look can you see what resembles like a brain that is disgusting you know but anyway, uh, it is the thymus gland of a cow. Oh and boy, we're having thymus gland <laughs> for supper. The thymus glands are right along the, the bottom of the throat area and stuff. So anyway, uh, they are very good when they are barbecued. Some people fry them. Uh, I don't particularly care for them too much fried. I mean, they're okay. I just like mine cooked on a grill. Uh, a light smoke flavor. It's very good. Um, but I'm cutting this one here into at least three or four pieces of fillets so that they'll all be the same size and cook all the same together. As you can see, it just looks like I'm cutting open a little brain. Ooh. <laughs> As you can see, like a little brain. <laughs> I mean, mmm. <laughs> That looks tasty. Gooby likes it. He's a dog. But anyway, yes. That's called Moyeka. Ew. And I'm going to be cooking them on the smoker. Y'all have to. Is that all we have to eat? No, I've got some ribs that I'm going to put on there also. But I don't have them out of the pack and marinated yet or uh, dry rubbed. Fixing to do that. But I'm going to salt and pepper these real good and let them sit a while. All right. All right. Okay. Now then, um, I got my uh, sweet breads all seasoned up real good sitting here. Salt and pepper real good. And they're, come, they're going to rest there like that. So keep them there. And then I have my ribs. These are pork ribs. Got me some dry rub. I'm going to be sprinkling all over it. And What's in that dry? I rub? can't tell you that. Well, couldn't you give away one or two ingredients? Uh, salt and pepper. <laughs> <laughs> well, that really helped. Well, all right, I'll give you one more. Smoked paprika. That's all the help I'm giving you. All right. Like I said, these are going to go in the smoker for several hours. This will be our dinner time food. flavoring on it.
wrap these up a little bit. Let them sit a little while. Just gonna let them rest at room temperature. Let all those juices get inside. They're all the flavor. I guess we'll uh, see you on the flip side. Okay. What I got here are the those ribs. I had uh, dry rub. Stick that on there. Put that in there. You can see the. Uh, can you see them? I'll I'll be over there in a minute. All right. So I'm going to put them in there. Oh, are you going to put those others on too right now? Yeah. Yeah, I'll wait and go over. And this is the plate of mojacas that I had salt and peppered. And yep. <laughs> and grossed everybody out with. Yeah, but they sure are good. Thing we're lacking is the pack of tortillas, but I think we'll have to make a run for a tortilla. How many y'all like uh, mollejas? Ask how many know what you it know is. You know what mollejas are. <laughs> they should, because if they're watching the video, you just told them in the first part it's right. thymus glands of a cow. Cow's thymus glands. <laughs> now, oh, Jr. of Jr. Longoria's vlogs. I bet he knows what a oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, it's still recording. Wait, yeah. open it back up. We're gonna leave that blooper in there. I tripped. I, I've, I've already <laughs> stepped on the cat twice this morning, and now I tripped over something there. Okay. That got, looks like a lot of food. Got the mollejas there. Here. And they will they will shrivel up. They they have a lot of fat in them, sort of like. And then here are the ribs and stuff. I want to have them start. This. Well, you gave them some color with paprika and stuff, but those old glands down there are just white. Oh, but they'll uh, they'll start turning that brown crispiness. It'll have a coating on it that seals in the internal parts. The un the internal parts would be a white. Um, You're getting way too descriptive. Kind of a pinkish white. <laughs> You know, but I mean, it's really, really good with that brown crust on them. Put them in some tortillas, maybe a little avocado, tomato, onion, mm, mm, mm. cilantro. We have cilantro too. Mm. I just might make a pico de gallo. Ooh, with, that'd be even better. With a little bit of, I don't know if I want to cube up the uh, avocado in it or on the side. Mm. Ought to be good either way. And then we're gonna have some good old mustard potato salad. It's homemade straight from Walmart. Right. It is some good stuff. I like it. Not as good as yours, but I like it. Thank you. It's a lot uh, uh, easier to make. Definitely. <laughs> if they cook these mollejas like I like them, I'd just buy them cooked. But you can't get them very much anymore. Um, we used to have a place there in Kingsville years ago, and I think that's when you first started eating mojitas, was at El Hardin's. Remember that? I remember El Hardin. I don't remember eating mojitas. Oh, yeah. yeah. They had wonderful mojitas there. And, uh, and back in the day when I liked to drink a margarita margaritas. or two, they sure had some good ones. Oh, yeah. They were like a dollar margaritas, big old margaritas. And then you can have mojitas and whatever you wanted. They were really good. 
but that place Tacos Al Carbon. Yes. But that place burnt down. They just never redid it. That's sad. But anyway, we'll let this cook for a while. I want to have it cooked in probably about 275, something like that. About how long? Uh, it is, it'll take several hours, that's for sure. Okay, am so, I going to stand here and stare at you for two hours on film? You think you could talk for two hours? <laughs> hey! All right, and with that, we'll check back in later. I don't know what it's going to look like. We'll see. It smells good. I'm going to put some specs on so we can check it out. Oh, it looks like it's... Ooh. Ooh. The messes are falling <laughs> That looks delicious. Look at those crispy thymus glands. Mm -hmm. If you guys had smell of vision you'd know how good so it is. What do you think? Huh? Oh, I don't know. Right. I don't know what a thymus is supposed to look like when it's done. Well, I mean, it's... Let me... Uh... Just pull that little thicker piece and see. Thomas. Thomas Eaters. That right there. Thomas Cook. Here's a sweet bread. Mm-hmm. Very good. Oh yeah. Not too dried out is good, I think. You I better think it taste might all it. be ready, don't you? you? Think? I don't know, you better taste that thing. I don't want no half cooked thymus. No, that that thymus is cooked. You're Cooks. sure? Yeah. I've just uh wondered about those ribs. What do you think? How many hours? Has it been? Well, what time is it right now? Let's see. Isn't it like 3.30? Is it? 3.44? Yeah, it's been a little over two hours. So I think it's ready. It wasn't a very large rack. No. So Are you saying I don't have a very large rack? I didn't go there. <laughs> Are you going to edit that part out? They're very tender, though. Uh. <laughs> well, let's see if I can get this. Don't mess up now, George. Well, don't be dropping them on the floor. You'll have to edit it out. And then don't tell me, and then I eat one that I get. They're coming apart. Well, they must mean they're really done, right? Huh? They're coming apart. They're yeah. well done. Yeah, they're done. There's no doubt about that. Well done, Thymus Gland. Mm. So we decided we did not have flour tortillas but we do have corn tortillas and we don't want to leave to go to the store so I personally like corn tortillas uh, heated up on the, the stove. gas stove and yeah. it gets the char marks on it mm. and I think you mentioned something about having some kind of veggies yeah Ooh, look at that look at that mm. rack of ribs you mm. better hold on tight to that you got two big animals back here behind you Rack number two. Well, Mr. Matt, I wish you were here this weekend, but yeah, look at that. Mm. You look so good. Tex, you look so good. Mama, you look so good. Mr. Rib and Mr. Thymus, you yeah. look so good. Mm, mm, mm. They are so hot. They sure smell good. Mm, but they're going to be good. Let's take them in. Let's take them in. Mm. Piece of thymus. Mm. Mm, that one had a little crunch to it. Think it's time? Huh? You think it's time? Huh? You think? Ooh, wee. Huh? What do you think? Mm hmm? You think it's supper time? Ow! Yeah? You think it's supper time? Huh? What do you think? Yeah? <laughs> yeah? What do you say? Ah, ah. Right now? Ah, ah. All right.
right. You finally get to sit down and taste the fruit of your work. I'm you on will. the flip side now. Huh? Let's see here. Let me get a closer look there. I Could you my, point out what you have? Yes, and... I have my mollejas under here with avocado, lettuce, tomato, green onion, some lettuce. I have my potato salad, homemade, straight from Walmart. And then the ribs, nice looking ribs. I drizzle them myself with Bullseye original. I do like Baby Ray's, but Bullseye was my original. Um, I have the same thing. I have two of the tacos with the crispy mollejas, uh, lettuce, tomato, and avocado. Some of the Walmart uh, potato salad, and only one rib to start with, but um, I guess we check back in a little bit. You betcha. Isn't it good, Gooby? <laughs> well, I have finished my two Moyeha tacos, and they were delicious. I am still working on that rib, but I am pretty full up to my eyeballs. How about you, sir? <laughs> yeah, I'm full. Did you enjoy your ribs, potato salad, yeah, mollejas? I had two tacos, mollejas well, tacos, crammed to the gills as you saw it, and then uh, I ate that whole plate. Mm. I'm full. So, if y'all like what y'all saw, give it a thumbs up or thumbs down, whichever you prefer. Subscribe for sure. Hit that notification bell, that way you'll know that when we put out a video, do it for all the other guys too. Let y'all watch, make sure, because sometimes YouTube uh, disconnect you and you got to reconnect. But uh, anyway, until we uh, see y'all again, happy Moyaha Day. <laughs>